Ah! HD lighting. That does look better, though, doesn't it? Yeah. Much better. Right, so we're just going to do a quick start guide here for Cyclades, so you can get stuck in straight away. Um, you know, th this you can find this on the back of your player screen, so you know you can use it as a reminder. But we'll quickly go through what they all mean, because uh, you know you don't really need to read the book; you just need to. Yeah, just you have to a use quick these. Look. Yeah, so, it's, yeah. It's, it's great. They just use a symbol to simplify everything, and it's so self-explanatory. Yeah, I mean these over here, like you know, they're they're obvious, but we'll just go through what the creatures do individually, save you getting the leaflet out over and over again. So this first one here, um, he can. Trade anchors for for Game Boys. Yeah. As you see, you got the anchor and the Game Boy. Yeah. Swap symbol. Yeah. They, so that's easy enough. This next guy, obviously, like he's got this temple, and he can change it to a different type of temple. It's got like a dome on the top. An architect. So, yeah. So he's, uh, he's the architect. He can. You see. can just whenever you've got a temple, you can just redesign it to get <laughs> some bonus points. Yeah. Um, this guy, um, he's a uh, he's he can go bowling. He can you go can see. bowling. Yeah. The, yeah. Just the bowling symbol there on the right. And. and uh, this guy kind of synchronizes well with the temple character because um, you redesign a temple and obviously you want to keep it clean. So this guy's got to take his shoes off before going into the temple. Yeah. You see the, sh the, like, the, the shoes symbol. You know, and, and it shows people. a specific temple there with the cross, but it uh, applies to any temple. Any temple in the game, yeah. Uh, time is, time money. is money. Time is money. <laughs> so, Number yeah. five here. Definitely. Time is money. It's and, uh, obviously, that, that's always good to remember. Yeah, and obviously that, that links as well with this cat. He's very economical because he can pay for bowling, but obviously he only does it at night. When yeah, because yeah, you can see that in the middle so there, just powerful. a little half sun over the arrow. Yeah. And, uh, uh, this owl is not a man. He's, he's not a man. You see the <laughs> he's X. not a man. You can see big X simple. through the man. So that's easy enough. So, yeah, okay. These guys he's, use a... These guys use a bird to transport to an island. Is it a bird? Is a, yeah. it's, a, it's a horse's face. Horse's face. With wings, though. With so, wings. Yeah. So, yeah. so basically, if they want to go on holiday to Ibiza, they have to use this horse's face. Yeah. You know, go on. Uh, the, this guy's really, really good at, good at really bowling. Good at bowling. Yeah. Like, so he's, he's like this guy, but he's just a bit more, yeah. bit more powerful. Really useful in the mid game. Uh, uh, yep. Yeah. This guy, um, if he's got a ship, he can basically trade it for a smaller ship that's got an eye on. Yeah. It's quite so useful. That's, that's yeah. good. Uh, yeah. This is obvious. Like, this it's, is. Just a this party. is just the part, big party. Everyone yeah. just throws a party. Everyone, just everyone gets in the middle. Everyone gets in the middle, and uh, it's yeah. great. This guy, he needs to turn his ship round ten times before he can go anywhere. Yeah, he's just a, he gets a real good look at everything. Like he's, he's sort of a scout. Yeah. So this one's a little bit small, but you can see maybe like he can't. There's a little arrow symbol here. He can't fire arrows at winged horses or at people who have taken their shoes off or at Pegasus. Right. So, um, but he can fire arrows at like a lot of other things, which makes him very useful against air units. Yeah, yeah. Um, this there's a fly. You see the flying, like octopus, flying octopus. Like yeah. this guy can't. He escape can't. He can't escape. So if, if they, this guy, if you get this card played against you, then just use a flying octopus and you'll be fine. <laughs> yeah. Right. Um, this guy, he's he's either a bull or he's two men. Yeah. And you, can, and you change that. Yeah. At any point in the game. Whatever. Yeah. Which is and very so useful. So whichever you think is going to be great for you at the time. Yeah. Uh, what's this guy? <laughs> this guy. Um, he's, he's most powerful he gets a buff when he's surrounded by boats so you can see there is in the middle and he's got a little eye opening saying he's surprised but there's a boat there and a boat there and he gets a super buff from that like yeah. a big bonus against all ships and then this little green tentacle guy he's, he is not he's not this ship he's not this ship or this, or this ship, ship just and that's in case you got confused just important to remember and so I'd say you know that's pretty much all you need and you're about ready to play so you know yeah, get stuck in and have a great time great with a great game. game have a great great type of game where you can uh just you can really just you can really get just it straight out of the box, out of the and, box just and just go. Just play, yeah. No, so, yeah. Need, no need to read the rules.